Boris Johnson has been moved into ICU as the British PM's battle with coronavirus takes a turn for the worse. Boris Johnson was taken to St Thomas's Hospital over the river from Number 10 Downing Street. That's right, British Prime Minister Boris Johnson moved to intensive care after coronavirus symptoms worsen. And then tonight, his conditions worsened, and now he's in an ICU, which is an intensive care unit. He's not being ventilated, but only the most serious people go to this, and so it's a big worry. Not only everybody else is worried, I'm pretty sure Boris Johnson's worried about the situation, but at least he's not on a ventilator. And to have the person leading that charge, the Prime Minister, um, in hospital, he's conscious, but he's not being ventilated, but he, he is in, in, in intensive care. A big worry here, and a shock across the political spectrum. Not only that, I was in shock, I'm pretty sure you're all like, oh my god, as well. Five days before that, because typically you have it for five days in your system before you show the symptoms. So he's had it for two weeks. He's had a temperature for ten days, and that's why he is brought in. So I came across this article, and I thought probably you already knew about this, but if not, then I'm educating you all that pretty much Boris Johnson, the Prime Minister of Britain, is now in intensive care. Also on a side note, has anyone ever noticed that Boris and Trump almost look eerily similar, like they could be brothers? Also, who wouldn't pay to see this movie? So that really sucks that he's in intensive care. Hopefully it gets better. My prayers and blessings will be with him, and I'm pretty sure you all have been in prayer for him as well. So yeah, let me know your comments and opinions down below. Please like this video and subscribe. It helps me out a lot, and I truly do appreciate it. Thanks for watching, everyone. Stay home, stay safe. God bless you all, and peace out.